I'll probably level him up later. Alright. That's a dead end, but there's... Oh, that took me back to where I was. Son of a bastard. No, wait. I was going... Ah, oh, god damn it. Okay, so there's something over there. I'm gonna go over there and get it, and then I'm gonna come back here, and then I'm gonna go and... That was the way. Now, at least this is less cryptic than like, hey, press this button and the rock will go away. The only reason why I'm doing this is probably a treasure chest around here. That's the reason why. Piss you off. I was annoyed watching you do it, dude. It was that bad. Like, it, it was one of the things where it's like you're sitting there watching and you're just like, is it over yet? I mean, but it's the thing. The thing about it that was weird. Uh, no, I couldn't because it uh, it poorly didn't explain it to you on one note. And then on top of that, um, you have to not only get past the moving um, the moving. What the fuck am I? Uh, for what? I give up. I don't want to climb this thing anymore. If Wynn can make the climb, then we can make it too. At least I hope so. I guess we chose the right path. I don't. I sure as hell don't like blind speed runs. Dude, that's like the reason why that was highly annoying in my and like just by looking at it. Is because, hey, you gotta do, gotta go from point A to point B. Hey, you have to go ahead and uh, also do this puzzle right. Hey, if you don't do this puzzle right, guess what? You gotta start all the way over, and certain things won't be resetted, but you still have to start all the way over. And plus, if you run out of time, you're slowly dying. Can you tell us more about the X9 Knights? They're no good nefarious the meanies who want to fill in a crow's worlds with hatred. N nefar So what you're saying is that they don't play fair. Well, that much goes without saying. Alright. But no, it was just like that's annoying, dude. And then like when you like when you that time when you rage quit it, like I was like, you know what, that's perfectly understandable. And please don't tell me I have to like warp to a different thing. If I have to go back, I'm going to be highly annoyed on this because this is a stupid part. Alright. There's a switch on the other side. I guess we're doing this. Come on!
the part that also annoyed me, it was like, oh, by the way, to start this cave, you have to literally uh, choose which, what command do you want not want on you, or what what things that you want, um, uh, what things you want to give up. And it's like, hey, you got to give up X command in order for you to get through this. You got to give up Y command to get through this. And it's like, why do I have to give up commands to go through this? Because it gives you time. And if you don't complete it in a time limit, it's in the blue spheres. Like, dude, all, you could have literally got all red spheres the entire time. And I would, and I think we would have all been okay. Because all red, yes, would have been the lowest version. But at the same time, it would be, you'd get you through it. But it's like, to get all red, you technically have to purposely lose. You purposely have to get, like, zero on the timer. So that means you have to purposely go through the entire area while dying slowly. That sounds like fun, right? Mega Phoenix, thank you. Oh no, when you when I when I saw you act I, I don't know if that was accident or not, but when you gave up the um, escape command, I was really scared, dude. I was like, dude, you gave up the one command that was going to make this so easy. Cuz some of them cuz like it shows that the first few floors are not that bad. Ooh, three-headed dragon. Because it shows that some floors aren't that bad and other ones are. Oh, speaking of which, before I forget, I've made like two stupid mistakes in this game already. Trying to heal one hat reflect on was the stupidest thing I could have ever done. I have one of those. I know. Okay, I do a crap ton of damage. Poison! Healing horn. Don't kill the cat. Got the cat. I already got those. You did it. Good job. But yeah, no, like, like, cause if the thing that sucks is first of all, you have to go through there within the time limit that doesn't stop even if you're in the, if you're in, um, battle. Um, I totally missed reading that. Sorry, but it's a manticore. And I'm going to call her... Umbrix. Sounds like a good name. And leave a Seraphie. I got a lot of things I need to do with those. Stabby. <laughs> if I could fit that all in there, I would do I would have done it. But sadly, I can't fit all of that in there. Which way did I come? My destination's over there somewhere.
I was going the wrong way. I still love the, I'm not gonna lie, I still love the speed up of the giant cactar because it just looks like he's moving at a speed, like he's just doing the fastest workout known to man. Like he's just like, I'm just going, he's just going at straight up like 50 miles per hour, just moving back and forth, back and forth. Ends are going to take me to a teleporter. <laughs> no pain, no thousand needles. <laughs> macho man, it's like Macho Man Cacta with my mustache. Ready to put you in the world of hurt. Oh, that automatically toppled my stack. You bastards. Now it wants that to be an advertisement. Oh yeah, snap into a cactus! Killing horn too good. No trouble at all. Now you just wanna just make it now you just gotta like put like just like ant like just like casually like Photoshop freaking um Slim, like slim cactar gems in his arms. Ah! I love how you instantly start us off with bio. <laughs> Yo, that needs to be a thing. Throwing stones is weak to me. Just a slim gem covered in goddamn spikes. Fucking your mouth is just like all bleeding every time you eat one, but it's so good you can't resist. Let me check my stacks right quick. You got 12.
currently right now less physical damage taken but raises magical damage taken it's not bad but like that hurts Doesn't hurt. <laughs> if it doesn't hurt, it's not tasty enough. So like now, um, since this has the ability of Joyride, if I were to, if I were to transfig into this version and I had it on me, um, I would be able to just automatically uh, ride on uh, Fenrir. It's back like freely. because I'm gonna start needing to use poison stuff later on that's gonna be a next beautiful evolution all right flying around your Fenrir you can go on all fours and ride down but mine mine takes to the skies And insert like freaking the Michael Jackson for the Michael Jordan uh, uh, Space Jam little thing with fly like an eagle. But it's like fly like a Fenrir to the sea. Fly into the future. Insert terrible singing. We beat him once, we can beat him again. I don't think that Brandalus guy was even trying before. Well, so what? I wasn't trying either. Thanks, Lon. That's so good to know. Yeah, very encouraging. Hey, uh, what can I say? Oh, you can't fly. You can't fly freely all the way. We'll give you some of it. See, the worst thing about this is like, I'm thinking about who, who. Tama, do you know anything else about those three heralds? Nothing the first hand. The X9 Knights are the like an army. They have the lots of members, so it's no the wonder I haven't met the three here in Grimoire. There's that many of them? Dude! Not only that, the ones with names and the numbers are the cruelest and most dangerous of all. Each is responsible for the destroying many of Inacro's the worlds. Didn't the champions rise up to stop them? Of course they the tried. Without the champions, the whole Googleplex of worlds would have the fallen. But wait, don't all three of the heralds have names? They sure the do. We've the heard them call each other by those names. I've never the seen three of them in one place before. Well, don't worry. We have the champions and a whole host of mirages to help us protect Grimoire. Right. So come on, let's get this done. All right, now that you're done with exposition, because I didn't want to meet, leave, and then like you go straight into something, and then like a boss comes up or something weird happens. Mega Ether.
I saw something shine. Maybe I was just seeing things. I love the fact that his attack is just he stomps on the ground and it kills you. It's like, man, stop! Did you snap at one? No! Out of my place. Remedy Plus, really don't need because I have a horse. Remedies? I got McStabby, I'm alright. I love the fact that anytime you hit the car one, the motorcycle one, it, just sound, it has to make like brake sounds to so, like break itself back. It's like, whoa, hold on. You hit me kind of hard there. Time to move on. Last time this side gave me a monster, so I think this time. Yep, there we go. Got an elixir. Wait, I, I went back the same way I did. Hold on.
And it's dead. All right. Now I'm gonna touch that again. Alright, we made it to our location. Let me check around here right quick first. Nope, that's just another teleporting place. The one right here, but we're at our destination, so... Let's not hit anything else. All right, here we go. This is it. The final stronghold. Castle X9. The silence is giving me the heebie-jeebies. All the same, way the too creepy. I love the fact that they did though a thing where it's just like only G only you guys can get in here because our stubby hands can't touch the control screen. It doesn't make a handprint. You guys can make a handprint though. So good luck. Let's begin because I feel a lot of bullshit's about to happen. It's too strange to belong in this world. Sometimes I think you are too. But yeah. There's what really good luck everyone. There is no map. Just walk and pray to God. It's like what's the map? There is none! what don't even pretend you forgot what that is so we're already inside the danger zone i think the so they're powerful enough to recreate bits in the pieces of their own worlds inside the threshold 
just the like this. Wait, but that means if we go kaput... I might not be the able to rewind you to safety. You have to be very the careful. Long story short, if you die, I may not be able to take you back to the world, or you'll have to. Dude, it'll be pretty much game over, so. Just be careful and don't die. I think I feel like I'm already kind of properly leveled with this part anyway. See, if your thing was something similar to this, I'd be okay with watching it and you don't have to worry about stuff. But it's like, no, they gotta put you through hell for yours. And I'm just like, Jesus Christ. I mean, I got my one little hell mode side content and it's fighting a giant fucking Nega Prime. Nega Prime, form up and roll out. By the way, here's a fist. Thresholds are more than just barriers, aren't they? Technically, they're more like a powerful force field, inside of which the world's rules can be the bent and great feats performed. So, whenever we step through a threshold, we're stepping inside someone else's private world? That's the right! I knew it wouldn't take the long for you to understand. But for someone to the create a world this physical, this real inside their threshold, they would have to expend a tremendous the amount of energy. Not just anyone can do it. All that soul crystal being sent here. Right. It's, uh, probably doing the, um... It's okay, Lon. You don't have to contribute. Well, whatever form a threshold takes, we know how they work in general, so at least we'll be ready. That's the right. And you may not have the noticed, but both of you have thresholds too. Whoa, really? Huh? I think Lon's head is the starting to smoke. All this info must have finally blown his mind. 
the greatest delivery in game history. That. Whatever that was. Yep, 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 yep. Stabby levels up. I can't wait for McStabby to get his next form. I'm mad that we don't have like a mean look move here. That was a good Predictable. I hate when that happens. Trying to capture him, trying to capture him, run us away. Son of a bitch. Only thing I hate about this. There you go. You're out of here. Good job.
Stabby is happy. here. Doesn't the Federation worry about sharing a castle with them? Somehow I doubt it. After all, a wolf knows better than to bear his fangs at a behemoth. They don't stand a chance against the King of Bahamut. There's just this something about him that feels fundamentally the different than the other two heralds. Oh, for everyone wondering, I'm only stopping so I can get the exposition. Because I don't want the cutscene to the cutscene to get stopped by a battle like this. Yeah, we got this. I guess we're doing this. Alright. Uh you know what? What did it do? What happened to your substats? And while you like red mages, you aren't a red mage, pretty much, right? means here we've made it to a first fight let's have a ball with this shall we
Isn't that the carbuncle that was with Alwyn? I mean, the woman in the mask? Dude, it's on! Let's make this good. We can catch it? Ah, uh, this one isn't. But hey, it's dark. So you instantly have reflect on. Alright. Never mind. Yeah, I, I, I was like, maybe if I just do this, it's no auto, just instant auto reflect. Did we beat him? I don't feel his presence. Hopefully, that means he's gone from the castle. If. Hopefully that means he's gone from the castle, if nothing else. This is what happened. Auto reflect. Oh. I'm not really worried about capturing those guys. You know, thinking about it, then I thought about it. I was like, nah. I'll be alright. Right.
Lightning Spellstone, thank you. Oh my god. Oh dear Jesus Christ. That per that's perspective threw me off. Oh, I forgot. I, God damn it. I keep forgetting that this is not other games. I guess. Thank you, Confusion. Does does drain on self? Doesn't affect, reflects back to person? Does drain on actual person? Anyway, Han, just keep it cool. Uh, sorry, I'm just so excited we're finally gonna beat those guys that I'm getting impatient. <laughs> Don't worry, Alon, I'm just as annoyed at these enemies as you are.
Alright. Trying to move along, get along here. I may do another RPG after this. Um, I really want to do the Nino Kuni series because I heard that one was really good, and I haven't touched it. I need to touch it or play another Final Fantasy game, one or the other. Maybe finally beat seven. Or finally fully finish up Legend of Dragoon. I got a list of things I need to finish. Or play something new that I haven't played before. Many ideas, many times. I need to fall right quick. Thank you. That was a good button. Oh, hey! 